What's going on everyone? My name is Denise Kozar. In this video I want to show you how to make velvet material in Corona Render. So, first of all, you create Corona material and uh, assign it to the object. Next, I will start interactive so you can clearly see what's going on. And um, here we just pick up fell off map and uh, plug it into the diffuse color. If you look at the reference you can see that it's pretty dark in the front and pretty light on the sides. So we will try to replicate this. Fall off type will be perpendicular parallel as it's more contrasting and uh, let's change the color to something like purple or any other color that you like and make it pretty dark 2 or 1 for the value next you can just copy it and make more lighter so it's be like this After that, we need to adjust the curves. So first of all, add new point, maybe here, and uh, move it down. So we need to make the side more lighter than the middle part. So for this, use busier corner or busier smooth. Um, for the middle point I prefer to use busier smooth and uh, change it like this and after that move it down. So we have this gradual gradient from the middle to the side. And uh, here we can also change to the busier corner and keep it maybe like this so as you can see we need light color here and the dark color here you can use it as a helper to adjust the material darkness or lightness of the diffuse texture so it's all about your tastes, how it looks in your scene, so feel free to adjust these curves. And uh, let's move on. Next we need to add the bump map, so I will use cellular for this to replicate these small parts of the fabric. We need to change cell color to the black, division colors to white and make it the smallest available size that 3D Max uh, can give us. You can just right click on these arrows and uh, it will decrease it for the minimum value. Next you can adjust bump strength if you want but for me it's pretty well with the default value next we need to add reflection so just pump it to one and decrease glossiness to something like 0 0.3 or 0 0.4 or any other values that looks pretty well in your scene. Keep uh, these parameters and uh, fall off type adjustable cause different lighting or different scenes may react different. 
so as you can see we've got this nice looking material and uh, I hope you like it if you have any questions please ask me in the description or in the comments below the video and um, thank you for watching see you next time bye